For the past week and a half or so, I've been sick and the symptoms have affected my voice. So all the excessive coughing has caused my vocal folds to press together excessively for a long period of time. And that causes stress at the vocal folds. It causes swelling and just complications. But what has been encouraging for me, because you know, I've been through this before, it was a reminder about the necessity for vocal protection. When you're sick, it's like you have to lean on coordination and the conditioning that you've done up to that point to carry you through. And so for me, especially being a lighter voice type, an essential aspect of vocal protection is feeling like my vocal folds are surrounded by like a a cushion, a barrier of buoyancy that doesn't allow them to press together too severely. That's essential when sick because since the vocal folds are swollen, you're gonna lose some edge, you're gonna lose some clarity. So you don't want them excessively compressing. But even when you're not sick and your vocal folds are in perfect condition, you still don't want over compression because that leads to vocal fatigue and other issues down the road. And so when I'm at my best, singing and most secure with my voice in terms of stability and stamina and just overall function again it feels like a barrier of buoyancy or cushioning around my voice and regardless of the dynamics that i use it's protected i can be loud i can be soft i can be in between i can do all different types of sounds and it seems like i'm like singing on a trampoline of sorts what gets a lot of singers in trouble is that there's too much collapse, there's a lack of space, there's too much compression and, and the vocal folds are overworking. That's, that's not gonna serve you well immediately nor down the road. And so having that sensation of buoyancy and cushioning around the voice is just essential for me. And the number one thing that leads into that type of experience is learning how to utilize my breath through various exercises that give my body space. You know, space deep into my body, lengthening it, opening it up. And once that that breath has like packed into my body, you know, and kind of like pumped me up in a sense, then it's like I'm singing on air. I'm singing on sturdiness, I'm singing on buoyancy. You know what I mean? And so collapse is, is less severe. And when I feel like I'm on top of that, again, like that trampoline effect where my voice just has like a cushion underneath it, flexible, but still sturdy, then the security of my voice is just optimal. And I love it. <laughs>